speaking and welcome to this video. Right, I'm on the way to my auntie's again. This is day two, hopefully the last day, uh, painting up her kitchen. So I thought I'd have another drive and chat. Um, and this time I'd like to chat about the dislike button on YouTube. Um, now, I think it's probably one of the last remaining uh, social platforms that actually has a di dislike button left. Um, pretty much everywhere else just got rid of it. Now, I want to have a chat about this dislike button because I, I want to find out from you guys what exactly do you think the dislike button actually achieves. Now don't get me wrong, um, please don't get me wrong, um, I appreciate that obviously people are going to dislike uh, videos, I mean it's, it's natural, you know there's videos that I don't like. Um, but I never press the dislike button, you know, I, if I don't like a video I either just won't watch it um, or more often than not, I will just make a comment about, a constructive comment, you know, not a nasty comment, just a constructive comment about, you know, if it was like poor sound, just say, oh, you know, sound wasn't that great, or what, you know, whatever. And whatever the reason is that I just like something, um, I would actually put in the comments rather than actually pressing the dislike button. Um, what I find the most annoying thing is not actually knowing what the dislike was for. Now I appreciate people aren't going to like dis you know people aren't going to like all of my videos. So I appreciate that. I feel actually very lucky because I have you know 3000 subs and to be fair I hardly ever get a dislike. I mean one dislike maybe on a video two if I'm really really unlucky. <laughs> uh, but usually you know no discount this no discounts. <laughs> no dislikes. Um, and I'm very, very grateful of that. But when I do get a dislike, it, it really gets to me. It doesn't get to me that someone's disliked my video. I mean, that's natural. But what gets to me is why that person has pressed the dislike button. It's like, I can't, I can't improve anything if I don't know what the dislike button was for. Because more often than not, people won't leave a comment. You know, you'll get a dislike, and there'll be no negative uh, comments, you know, in the video. Um, so I just always rack my brain, saying, well why has that person not liked it? You know, is it like, the quality of my painting, is it the type of video that I put out, you know, that maybe it's 40k and somebody doesn't like 40k, maybe it's because it's a Necron video, people don't, don't like Necrons, you know, is it my voice, is it my accent, is it the lighting, is it the sound, um, is it the titles, maybe the intro's too long, you know, why? Why has that person pressed the dislike button? And that's what I find the most frustrating. Um, I don't know, is there a solution? Maybe we could have a dislike button, but there's like a drop down box, you know, that if you want to press the dislike button, the drop down box comes down, and you have to put, you know, choose one of the, like, um, uh, uh, one, one of the things that comes up, you know, like poor sound, dislike poor sound, or dislike content, dislike, you know, whatever. Um, I don't know if that's a solution or not. Um, I really don't know. Um, and I was thinking, well, what about as opposed to having, say, a dislike button and a like button, what about if we had, like, a star rating button? So you can either press one star or five star, you know, um, like the video will start on three stars, for example, and then obviously as you get, like, four or five stars, that creep up, and if you get some two one stars, it creeps down. It gives you a general idea of, of how people like the video. Well, I don't know, is that a solution? I don't know. I don't know if that will actually, will still have the same impact in that um, you won't actually know why people are liking or disliking your video without them actually putting a comment down. So, yeah, why do you dislike a button? Why well, not dislike the button? Why do you press the dislike button? Um, are you one of those people that watches a video, press the dislike button, and then just clicks off to another video? Um, and if you do, what usually makes you press that dislike button? I mean, I've been on YouTube for what, probably five years now. I've never pressed the dislike button. Um, I understand people may like to press it. It probably makes them feel good when they press it. Um, but I, you know, if you are one of those people that do press the dislike button, and I, I, I plead to you, please, um, yeah, press the dislike button, no problem. But please, please, uh, leave a comment. You know. You know, it's just say I press the dislike button because, and let me know, um, because then I can move forward. You know, and if it's because the intro is too long, well, you know, I can then consider like a, a smaller, a shorter intro. You know, if it's 
you know, it's like you dislike the bus, you know, I dislike the bus because I want to see more Necrons, you know, whatever. I mean, whatever the reason, that's fine, because at least it gives me something to work on. Um, and, you know, that's not just me, that's for every channel that you go on to. Um, like I said, I feel very, very lucky because I, I really, honestly, I hardly ever get a dislike. That may change, may change after this video. <laughs> um, but um, no, I feel privileged and I really appreciate all of the support um, that, that every one of you that gives me because I always get an awesome amount of likes and an awesome amount of comments on my videos and uh, they're all very positive and if they're not positive they're all um, uh, you know, constructive um, criticism, uh, help, you know, and tips and links and you know, really useful stuff and I appreciate all of those very, very much. So, um, yeah, I mean, that's rounding up the video, really. Do we need a dislike button? Is there a better solution to a dislike button? Um, and why do you press the dislike button if you're one of those people? Let me know in the comments below. Thanks for watching.